The scope of SAP is pretty encompassing. In addition to doing the traditional finance and manufacturing areas, we're going very deep and very complicated in supply chain and engineering systems. At the very beginning, when we said, are we an ERP company or not, we could have said, you know what, our systems are okay. I mean, they were functioning. We didn't have issues. The question was, should we squeeze another 10 years out of that and maybe push this decision off a little bit? And in true swage lock fashion to our culture and our values, we weren't going to do that. And when you talk about value, it's a tricky thing with software, right? When you buy a piece of hardware, it's visible, everybody sees it, it's the shiny new car. Uh, software kind of sits in the background and connects everything and makes everything work. So how do you get the value out of that? In this one, the results are a little bit more, we call them foundational. Uh, you know, we use the analogy, if you're building a house, when you put in the foundation in the basement, it's not very sexy, but it's really, really important as you move on with it. So how do we tell the benefits? We can see some benefits already. Um, we can see that some of our associates in the finance and the supply chain areas have view to the entire organization in a much easier way than they did before. Supply chain will be, when we're done, we'll have all of our organization in one planning system. When we run our supply chain planning, it'll be together, not in multiple pieces. That allows us to get much more accurate information.